slow down. Mm -hmm. No, no, no. I'm going to shamelessly enjoy oh. this shaved Brussels sprout salad. You are. You while you stop, interview so. our oh. chef, Ryan Nelson. <laughs> That's really good. Chef Ryan, welcome to the show again. And Thank you. Um, uh, what are we doing this segment? Uh, we're doing a little fish, a little pan-seared mahi-mahi. I think mahi -mahi, that mahi, yeah. cooking fish for a lot of people can be kind of intimidating. I think people kind of shy away from it. Mm. They're, Why? they're Why scared that? that they're either going to overcook it or undercook oh. it. Mm -hmm. okay. and, um, That's why we need you. And to be honest, usually they, they do. They so do. <laughs> come to the restaurant, we'll do it for Which you. Which might be why people don't. I mean, they, they love it when it's at a restaurant, when they make it at home. Kind of like Brussels sprouts, you know? Yep. We sell a lot of fish at the restaurant, and I think part of that is, A, how we prepare it, but B, also, people don't generally do it on their own. So I've got the mahi, some salt, some pepper. I like to put a little uh, whole garlic clove in our pan and some uh, rosemary. And I'll do that if I'm cooking a steak or a pork chop or a uh, piece of chicken breast or something. The... The technique is the same. It's the, the ingredients that can change. Mm. So, like, you can have that, yeah. that rosemary and that garlic in there for anything, and it really adds a nice, uh, a nice element to the dish. Without being overpowering. 100%. It's very subtle. It seems like I always learned that from you, what the balance is to get the right mouthfeel and flavor. Sure. So, that, that's what it's all about is balance. So you were just telling us one of your favorite pastimes is deconstructing a fish, right? I love to butcher fish. It's one of the things that you I really like enjoy doing. Yeah. That. Yeah. Whole yeah. salmon, whole halibut, whole uh, mahi mahi. Oh, so, how big was that mahi mahi when it came to you? It was like big. Oh, four, like, four feet. like your arm wingspan, yeah, it was right? Like a Twenty plus pounder, forty five pounder. Where did you get it from? Uh, I think they were coming out of uh, Latin America. It was probably Nicaragua or, or maybe Panama. Wow. Okay. And then the thing you can kind of notice is the fish starts to kind of pull away from the pan a little bit. Mm -hmm. And when that starts to happen, you're close to uh, being ready to, to flip it. Now, while that's going, I've got some uh, roasted root vegetables, if I can manage. This is the vegetable candy I talked about. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. All right. I'm, I'm learning here, so. And that uh, that rosemary is so fragrant. Oh, yeah. It smells It fantastic. is just filling the whole studio. It's so good. It's and then I've got some root vegetables. Ooh, yeah. And these are just uh, salt, pepper, olive oil uh, in a pan for about 20 minutes. And I've got rutabagas in there. I've got... I'm putting out some smoke. Boy, you really are. I'm waiting for the we smoke. We need a hood system. We need a hood system. Um... <laughs> So I've got rutabagas in there, I've got turnips, I've got uh, carrots, butternut squash, potato, all kinds of stuff. Mm -hmm. Love the smell. Cooked right. perfectly. That out of there. Amazing. Really Add some butter. Yeah, butter. Take that off the heat. Put the butter in there. While we're doing that, we'll add this to our pan, and we're going to make a little sauce out of it. We're going to add a little bit of white wine to mm -hmm. both pans. This is going to smoke again. Okay. I, I, I'm guessing, Chef, that this is another popular item on the menu. It is. It is. We sell a ton of fish at the restaurant. He's getting a mahi-mahi facial right now. That's what's happening. <laughs> That's a lot of things coming up. We also add a lot of white wine to our food. Oh. Um, yeah. Sometimes it's to add flavor, but also sometimes it's to cool a pan down. Oh. If you got a wow. pan that's too hot, a, take it off the stove, but B, add some liquid to it. Okay. Right? That will work. So yeah. we've got a little bit of uh, roasted garlic head. Mm. Just kind of. How add long that. did that roast for? I'm curious. About 25 minutes. At? For... Uh, 350. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's one of those things I always seem to do wrong. I love garlic, I put it in everything, but roasting mm. it, I haven't been able to conquer. Now, when you roast it, you were mentioning earlier the, the sweetness of vegetables. The, the roasting actually concentrates all that all that flavor, mm -hmm. so they're going to be sweeter. You're going to get more flavor out of it by, by cooking it more. Yeah. So. You know, in Daybreak, one of the things Scott Sanders said about you is to, to thank you for taking what was so icky to him when you, you know, when as you're a kid, I remember this, yeah. walking into the cafeteria in elementary school, and they'd make spinach, oh, just yeah. boil it down yeah, to nothing, yeah. or Brussels sprouts, sure. boil it down to nothing. And yeah. I think that's where sometimes my memory as a kid, not liking vegetables, but when you try them this way, they're irresistible. It helps when it's properly cooked. Uh, yeah, yeah, everything, right? <laughs> nothing against the lunch, yeah. Nothing to get right. I Boy, think those things That looks change. delicious, doesn't it? Oh, my goodness. It it does. Does. It add incredible. that butter and Ooh, add yeah. it right back to it. Wow. So good. So this is something we can order if we wanted to go tonight, huh? For sure. Remind everybody of your hours again, Seth. Uh We are Monday through Saturday. We open at 5 o'clock. We're dinner only. Okay, looks All good. Right. So we're going to plate that up. We've we got are. just a couple seconds.
And where are you located, Chef? Did you say where you're located? We're or? up at uh, 86, uh, directly east of the Fashion Mall. Yep. Same side of the street. Ooh, yeah. Good. yeah. Good. Looks so yummy. All right. You know, I'll probably have to we'll try We'll be able to highlight this at the oh, end yeah, of the show, yeah, too. Yeah. You can, yeah, you try it before you go. Yeah, I just want to make sure it's okay for you. you Thank know, you, Alice. You're so selfless. <laughs> Good for you. Hey, Chef, we appreciate that. My pleasure.